Hello, hello everyone, and welcome back to Modded Terraria. We're going to pick up right where we left off and try not to die. The guys did make it all the way down, and apparently I'm still in boo there. But we're going to just keep going, and uh, we're going to live a happy life in this world. Let's go say hi to the gang. Hi, gang. Oh, I also do have life crystals that I have not used because I didn't want to accidentally spawn in the Eye of Cthulhu before. Probably a good idea. Yeah. Because we start at 180. I mean, I'm already at 200. I'm at 180. Oh, well then the Eye of Cthulhu could have spawned at any time. Yeah, it's a possibility. Oh, wait, do I not take fall damage now? Because of frog leg? Well, you, you still take fall damage. Oh, increase increased fall resistance. Yeah, it takes several more blocks. Do we have a pylon for the jungle? No. Um, we got one for the forest. What? On the other oh, side. Oh, dungeon. Yeah, yeah it, was, it was for the dungeon. Oh, which reminds me, we should probably get a, uh, probably get an arena started, yeah? Probably. Wouldn't yeah. be a bad idea. So, we also, um, this session, need to get somebody up into a, with the Sky Islands. Um, not even the Sky Islands themselves, but the planetoid that contains the laboratory. We're gonna yeah. want to start that. Okay. Yeah, we could definitely get that going. I'm back underground, of course. Oh, see, I, I thought you would want to go do that, so I... Uh... Oh, no, I will. I definitely want to. I'm just letting you know I'm underground right now. I can go back up. All right. Hey, where do I... Where do I get the wizard hat from? Traveling merchant. No, wizard. You, you literally get wizard hat. No. No, that's the hard mode one. Uh, recall. Give me a minute. Alright, yeah, so. Is... I was you... looking on the pre hard mode. Yeah, you get wizard hat from the merchant. Oh, I hate not having the pick saw. Or the, the pickaxe axe. Let's just go kill Gollum already, guys. Clearly we're prepared. We are, definitely. Um, so am I using wormhole potions to go find this stuff? You, uh, grab, uh, I mean, if we got rope. <laughs> I got 500 rope on me and I got one gravitation potion. You should be able Do to make infinite spawn. rope. All right, that one so, takes, I think, 999. It doesn't? I think it does. I looked it up. At one All right, hang on. What, what was the item? Unlimited, Unlimited rope. rope. So uh, I just need to have rope in the system. Well, you, yeah, you need to have it on your person. Oh no, sorry to to craft it. Yes, you need it in the uh, on your person. <sighs> now, do I just kill jungle monsters to get spores? Is that what it is? Spores are green underground. Yep. Recipe browser. I'm gonna give Josh the other two life crystals. Oh, we should have some vine rope. Oh no, no, we don't. Never mind. Uh, I, I, I still have all the ones I just took off on me. Yeah, 999 rope. Or vine rope. So I'm halfway to that. Should I just build up? Yeah, I would just start building up. came over this way because I can't remember if the jungle was actually this way or not. 
Uh, jungle. Is to the jungle right. Jungle is on dungeon. We have the no? jungle pylon all the way to the right. I'm stupid. Alright, here we go. Alright, so do I just kill things in the jungle, or I have to go down, right? No, you need to go underground. Josh, if you need jungle spores, I can go with you once I build up, if you want to come up with me. Uh, I'll be able to in a second. I'm just... I'm looking for a way down, just plotting a path. But this seems perfectly fine as an underground base. Oh, oh, you need to die. This is a goblin scout. Was I going to start the goblin event? No, no, but it does give us enough tattered cloth to finally start the goblin event. Hey, by the way, I found the thing that you want to press in. That's to script the planetoid? <laughs> yeah. So, inside the planetoid, there should be a, uh, I need to place this down somewhere before it gets lost. There we go. Yeah, I had, the, I had the planetoid with a lab. I think the plan, yeah, the planetoid was what was really exciting, and in case somebody didn't see it, I wanted it on camera. Because we didn't really do much with it while you played on the, the other one. Oh, wow. By the way, how do you like your 100 power pickaxe already? Love it. Yeah. Alright, what do you have to say? The power grid has been evilly compromised or researched. Yeah, okay. So they don't change too much what they say. So don't uh, don't get in range of those turrets. But these chests contain planner boxes and um, some other things that will be required. And I am just replacing these so they should be considered active. Okay. Did you get any power cells? Uh, power cells? I have none. Oh, no, there they go. Alright, I thought maybe I had to put one in first. Oh wait, my money got saved, that's right. Yeah, so, bank. why can't I go near these turrets? They'll hurt you eventually. Yeah, see, that one fired at you, it just missed. Uh, we can't mine it current- ow. We can't mine it currently, so... Alright! Rope. So before we do any um, like boss fights, I did put a lot of crates into the storage system, so you can take a look and see what accessories are craftable for you guys. Yeah. I also put in a lot of ore in there, so you should actually have a full set of platinum armor if you want it. I think I'm going just sticking with the angler armor until... Uh, Hard. Well, not until hard mode, but until King Slime, when I'll switch off to Ninja and just call it a day there. <laughs> like... Uh, I mean, I'm in lead armor right now, myself. Lead is okay. Does Calamity... Does Calamity take away the movement speed debuff it normally has? Uh um, does Calamity add a movement speed debuff to lead armor? It doesn't say anything about a debuff, it's just telling me... I think it removes it then. Hey Josh, I've got a gift for you. This might help you stay alive. Did I drop it? What happened? Mm -mm. No, nah, I favored it. It didn't drop. There we go. I mean, it's not much, but yeah. I want to let you know I'm jumping to planetoid to planetoid right now. Yeah, it all, all the little bit helps. I'm actually going to go see in here if there's a... Um... I oh, think cool. I'm go a little bit further. I'm thinking of a. How tall of an arena do you think we need for Skeletron? There's three extra mana crystals in the system if anyone needs them. Because I just maxed myself out. 
Mana crystals, huh? Um, I don't know if anyone wants to as a time being, but I did if they want crit. I do have a lucky rover drive. Ooh, so tempting. I just got 30 topaz. What I really need is the, um... Oh, there's... Two, 200. Now. 20, uh, iron ore. 330 yeah. copper. Oh, you're you're doing the planetoids. I was like, how the hell are you getting all this? Although that's what I just deposited in the system. I was doing planetoids till I fell. Yeah. I'm going back up. They'll go the other side. Okay, we've we've got a really basic arena for Skeletron. And I think our first, like, all of our pre-hard mode bosses. Oh, hey, I found the Harpy Village. Hey, you can buy a Star Fury. Actually, I can buy a Star Fury. No, you miss a jar, it. Enchanted Nightcrawlers, White Pearls, Star Fury. What? I can and buy it. What is the uh, what is the price on the uh, Enchanted Nightcrawlers? Uh, 50 silver for five? I'm not buying it. Oh, wait, 50 silver? Yeah. I'm buying those. Hold on. Uh, even though my uh, gold broadsword deals more damage, the Star Fury is a little better. Well, we need one Star Fury for the future, anyways. Actually, we're going to need hey, like, two of them. How did you just warp here? Pylon. That's another symbol. That's a pylon up there. Oh! oh right. I'm glad you reminded me because I was about to die of fall damage. Shiny red balloon. Got this in a jar. Yep. That's that was the other thing I wanted to come by. Um, is there anyone from Mage stuff here? Um, I actually have a balloon buff. I just realized. So somebody else who needs an extra jump height. I mean, everyone got fog legs too, though. To be fair. Yeah, I also have that bottle stuff. I'm I'm pretty much Gucci. If I'm nobody looking. needs it, I'm I'm buying it for storage purposes. Yeah, go ahead. Go for it. Okay. And then, oh. you already bought the Star Fury, right? Yeah, I already have a Star Fury. Okay, then I'm going to buy an additional one, throw it into the Storage. System. Yep. And then, I'm buying all the worms, so I don't have to worry about crafting it later. Yeah, I already have a Arcane Cloud in a Bottle, uh, Eucharist Socks, uh, wild Aglet, Frog Legs, and a Fleeting Radar. You, you, so, you can get rid of the socks because um, in the storage system with the wood crates, it's wood or gold crates. One of the crates, you can turn that, you can turn one of those into Hermes boots. Oh. Yep. Y'all ready for this? And then for the very first oh. boss, I mean, we're, we're probably set for King Slime... Tro I mean, we're definitely set for Trojan Squirrel. Wow, those Nightcrawlers are cheap. Yeah. And these yeah. are meant for fishing, right? Mm-hmm. I, I have messed up on my solar world and somehow made the Harpy Village cost way more money. My advice, don't, um... Don't dig up here. They don't like that. All right. I don't know if that's what it was or if it was something else, but yeah, it's something it did they didn't like. Right. Um, I don't think I checked. Oh, I've had to. All right, so you said that I can get crates in here. Yeah. Well, I mean, there should be crates there. All right. Yeah, so there's. Yeah. I see the Hermes boots I can make. Yep. And then I'm putting this guy in the middle. Awesome. So, we also don't buy bombs when we decide we want to start digging down. We actually have bombs. I, I'm not going to lie, I kind of want to make a gold set of armor just because of how it looks. Go for it. No point.
Yeah, platinum armor's not bad, actually, looking at it, but... Platinum and gold are basically the same. Platinum, I think, gives you slightly more damage with its crit bonuses, and then gold gives you slightly more survivability, because I think it gives you an extra defense point. Okay. Um... But it, it, it's the difference between, like, silver and tungsten, right? They're both on the same tier, so they're both going to be very similar. Yeah. I'm going to keep I my think... helmet on, though. Alright, I am I made a squirrel coat of arms, so we do have our first boss summon. I need to make a gold crown, I just realized. Well, I need to make either crown. I'm going to make a gold one. Cause... Oh, you made platinum armor. I did, should I not? No, 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 that's fine. I just, I was like, I thought I brought more platinum here. Alright, and Josh, you said you need jungle spores? Yeah. I've also made the goblin battle standard. I'm not going to use that yet, obviously, but... Yeah. Yeah. Er. Alright, where are you? You in the jungle? Yeah. Which way did you go through? How'd you get down over there? The tree. Oh, the right. We need a demon altar. Which I don't think we can make yet. No, we need to kill... Are we corruption or are we uh, crimson in this world? I think Ooh, look at all those vines over there, Josh. Yeah, hold on. I'm about to die. Oh, yeah. Hang on. My bad. Oh. Oh, crafting. Oh, I don't have breathing. I don't have breathing stuff. Don't lie. I just make air pockets like this. Wow. That reminds me, those crates can also be open for resources. Uh, which ways are corruption? Left uh, and right. Left. Yeah. Which one is closer? Uh, uh left. No, right. Right is. Right. Well, yeah, because left is over by the dungeon. Oh yeah, right's at the left of the jungle pylon. Oh yeah, I see you now. Oh. Ooh, look, another That's potion. Okay. All right, what's in it? Wood, silver coins, 20 bottles, recall, health, hurricanes, can of worms, and 254 throwing knives. So, nice. Yeah, I don't have the portion yet. I need to. Uh... When Preston wants to get going on that, you can't. You gotta. Wait, on what? When you wanna get going on your road. Hey, by the way, I have a demon altar here in the jungle. Oh, well, <laughs> as you said that, I finally made it to this one. Slime crown, there we go. Light up this little crevice. Mm, part of me wants to try and start, like, building the arena for Brain of Cthulhu. The other part of me really doesn't want to do it till I get armor. I do not blame you. Like, it's not too bad once I can get going with it. Where does jungle spores come from? Jungle spores light up as these green polyps. Wait a minute, did Jungle Sports even fucking spawn prior to, uh... Yeah. Yes. Well, actually, hold on, what were you gonna say? Because I, I had a similar to... thought. Could I... 
that I actually don't know. I've never went looking for jungle spores before to leave behind Cthulhu. <laughs> it is, however, listed under the pre-boss thing. Okay. So, it, my answer is it should, but it, it could be a case of Calamity reverted something they changed, right? Yeah. Oh. Well, doesn't mean I ain't gonna keep trying. Okay, yeah, no. I see what they look like. I can check the other world real quick and see if I've got any. No, you're good. Well, ah. well, I say that because I spent like two hours straight just Ooh, fishing in the jungle. Be for careful going into that. I know what I'm doing. Crates that I couldn't even get for those two hours because I didn't have fucking high enough fishing skill. I want to go see if I can find a chest in here, Josh. Yeah, no problem. You know, little birdie is actually doing a lot of work. Ah, uh, no chest. No chest. Oh, perfect. This is what we needed though, over here, Josh. So, if I come down here... There's a lot of I'm going to fail before I uh, kill the, uh, the hive, I think. It's not too much. Well, actually, you know what? I just realized I'm using the mini shark. I don't think I have to worry about that unless I want to kill it. Not exactly known for its DPS. Hey, look, more gold. You can always use more gold. Especially since I'm still wearing fucking angler armor. I'm trying to use the regeneration, regenerative powers of fucking honey over here. I mean, you can make a rejuve band. I think. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure you can make Reju bands off uh, crates as well. Yeah. Okay, we've got our first, like, few bosses all ready to go. I don't think this arena is big enough, but there's not much I can do unless I want to start bombing things. The one down here? The, the one for the Brandy Cthulhu. We'll see, though. We might be able to just punch through Brain of Cthulhu, no problem. It's the hive that I'm really worried about. Oh, there's a life crystal over there. I want it. Kill it! Yeah, that's a pinky! Oh my god, this is a goblin statue. Hell yeah. There we go. I don't know when we want to take on the Goblin, uh, standard, the Goblin army. Josh, I'm still not seeing any right now. I'm not either. Alright, where did you guys go? Stop. Right, huh? This left side's going outside of the jungle. Yeah, and I just found a life crystal. Do you want one, Josh? Do you need it or no? I have 220 right now. I'm at 220 also, so you can take it for you. I was about to say, you definitely should take this melee guy. Yeah, definitely. I'm we really fine should be getting you out of the 400 first. Yeah. I used the ones I got in my own world, and then I gave Josh two of them so he would actually have some extra HP. But I think from here on out, we're giving you any life crystals, and I'll manually craft some more with any rubies we can find. Which reminds me, if we find any more rubies, we need to make a, oh. um... Alright, yeah, I found a jungle hut. And I have a mesh mirror now. Oh, I mean, where? I'm trying to, like, follow your guys' path. It's not working very well. Uh, no, yeah, no. a lot of my path is going through water. I dig in a lot of water. And there's just, like, no torches anywhere. I have a mining helmet. I try to put up torches as I went, 
Alright, you guys went to a beehive, apparently. Yep. Yeah, we did. You know, it's kind of big enough. We could set up Queen Bee Arena, too. We already had one, though. Oh, you're right, we do. Okay. Get out of here. Oh, why did that drop me a stinger? Oh, murky paste. Um, Let's go. I'm gonna dig deeper underground. Maybe it's in. Well, no, you're in the underground layer. Yeah. Yeah, we are. Yeah, so that's not it. I thought maybe it just. Oh! Uh, hey, mage, I got mana jelly. Yeah, it, it's not uh, spawning until the eye is dead, I'm believing. That's what I'm gonna choose to believe. I... Because right here is where it would normally spawn in the world. Right below me. Okay, I I say we go back and fight our uh, bosses. Alright, no, that's fine. I, I do have a diamond rope. I just... Yeah. You I don't do have, have a enough. wizard hat, unfortunately, but that was RNG base. Yeah, it was. If nothing else, you can always swap to fucking ninja gear for the time being. Um, I Magic. can always do if you anyone can, you can also... against... Sorry. If anyone would be against it, if everyone would be, uh, would you mind if I just gave myself a uh, hat? Gave yourself you know what? what? I, have, I have more than enough money to have bought it. That's fine. Hey, uh, give yourself what? Oh. The wizard um, hat. The wizard hat, yeah. Yeah, sure. the, it, the second it, component, because it's, it, it's honestly, not craftable, it's, it's not obtainable other than the traveling merchant. Yeah. His whole setup pre-boss is all traveling merchant dependent. Yeah. For mage. All yeah, RNG wise. So, I do have an accessory for you though. I teleported back home. So yeah, I'm, I'm I'm already here. Go. Oh, and Sean, use this. Alright, um, do you want the vine book back? Nah, I, I guess. Well, no, you can you can hold on to it. I, I think this is good enough for this episode. Next episode, we're going to fight the bosses. Thank you, everyone, for joining us here, and we'll see you all on the next one.